Hello guys, this is the precise audio blog and today I'm going to show you how to find and use the track automation and the controller automation. Um, in my own opinion, I prefer the controller automation. Uh, it's more comfortable. So let's get started. I'm going to show you this with a um, virtual instrument in contact 5. Okay, so I had it here. I'm going to do all the process again so the first thing that you have here is a library I have my track here instrument one I have my sequence is that and I want to automatize the cutoff right so you go to auto and then you have like a lot of patterns 511 a lot so you drag it to the button that you want to atomize here cut off filter cut off see um, synthesizer and so on so now I'm going to find this in the controller um, you can open the controller with the letter P and here if, if, if it doesn't appear in your screen you have to call it with common or apple Y so here I'm going to go filter cut off and what you have to do is just drawing whatever you want. It says controller here. I'm doing it with the mouse. Um, I don't have a controller here, and for me, it's easier to do it like this. So, as you can see, right it's moving so sometimes I like to I like to do it with the mouth mouse here in the part of my English I'm very rusty um, with the mouse there so what I'm going to do it's just change here from read to touch and let's see how it goes okay let's see where that automation is it's moving right but it's not from here you see it's nothing here so when you do that you would say like where the hell is the automation you know I can't find it here and that's why I'm doing this tutorial so I'm going to come back to read and I'm going to press, selecting the track, I'm going to press A. <laughs> I'm sorry guys, I was cleaning the keyboard. And there you go. Here you have the volume, right? If you want to select, I'm going to take this off. If you want to select the automation here, uh, usually appears volume at first, but here the person got off let's see if the line here there you go that's the line that I just recorded and if you don't have that line okay I'm going to delete it
going to select that you don't go here I mean you can there's something there that I did I'm going to delete it now so automation select tool that's very sometimes you feel ah, I have to delete uh, point by point no you can just do it that I'm going to come back and when you got this you have to go to smart smart control controls in here what do you do here you draw whatever you want so you have both options so when you just turn this and you use touch or latch it's going to appear in the track automation it's not going to appear in the controller automation you see so guys i hope this is very helpful for you um this is the precise audio block and see you in the next video bye bye